presidential debate, followed by a straw poll, and Chris Gordon was there. He reports from our newsroom. Chris? Wendy, the student debaters were asked how their candidates stand on the issues like the war in Iraq, the economy, the environment, and immigration. This exercise in politics could come into use next week when they vote for real on Chesapeake Tuesday. Americans solve problems. We don't want Teams representing each candidate asked fellow seniors here at Falls Church High School for their vote. It's time for a change. And to speak quite frank, it took one Clinton to clean up after the first Bush, and it's going to take another to clean up after the second. Thank you. <laughs> Quote from Barack Obama, I want to campaign the same way I govern, which is to respond directly and forcefully with the truth. On the Republican side, Mitt Romney's representative withdrew for personal reasons. The other candidates were represented. During his term, Huckabee cut taxes, which saved the people of Arkansas $380 million. John McCain is a common sense conservative who believes in a strong national defense, a smaller, more accountable government. Ron Paul stands for dramatic change in the basic workings of our government. After the debate, the students voted in a straw poll. Barack Obama got 74 votes yeah, to Hillary Clinton's 52. On the Republican side, Ron Paul 14, John McCain 7, Mike Huckabee 1. There are about 270 members of this senior class, and many are registered to vote next week in the Virginia primary on Chesapeake Tuesday. I will be voting for either Hillary Clinton or Barack Obama, and the most important issues to me are the environment and immigration. What's the big issue for you? I'm definitely ending the war in Iraq. The major issues are foreign policy and the war in Iraq and immigration. My candidate originally was Fred Thompson. He dropped out, and then it changed to Giuliani. He dropped out. And as they both <laughs> threw their support behind McCain, I'm torn between McCain and Romney now. We have found a lot of local voters are still undecided. After today, the candidates will turn their attention to Chesapeake Tuesday next week. Is that all it was? In Maryland, Virginia, and the district, which could play a pivotal role in picking the presidential candidates. That's the latest from the newsroom. Back to you. And oh my God, that's so stupid! I said I had such a bigger role to play in that.